Hey, hi, how's it going? New Darko. Uh, I, I really gotta check this out. I love Darko. Uh, that's about all I need to know. Yeah, I doubt I'm gonna need the piano because it's a Darko song, but you know, I'd always just have it. So we'll see. Oops, it wasn't going through my headphones, it's going through my speaker. Alright, here we go. Funny suit. I wonder if it's a reference to Donnie Darko. Well, he hears the click track. I love this kind of scream that Tom does. It's so good. Classic Darko. <laughs> the drums. <laughs> you can't help but just laugh listening to how crazy this gets. This is why I love Darko. It's so chaotic. <laughs> yes. That was an abrupt chain. <laughs> Tom's so weird. So I can see why. Tom cleans. So I can see why friends become enemies. They're doing my favorite chord progression again. One of my favorites. The one to six. It's a vibe, but it's so heavy. <laughs> Those drums are so punchy. That felt a lot longer than four minutes, but in a really good way. Tom's done cleans before, right? I'm pretty sure... Doesn't he... Doesn't he sing on Infinite Beauty? On Oni? Yeah, nobody else is, is credited on this. Okay, no, 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 no. He, he's, he's definitely sung before. Okay, alright. He's, he's absolutely sung before. I don't know why I'm... Somehow thinking that he hasn't. Because he had Take your hand in my... I'm so tired of it. And then, of course, there's Donna. I forgot about Donna. 
I saw you again. I try to say they're good in everything. This dude, their self-titled, I think, is is their best album by far. They haven't done a lot of albums, you know, but self-titled is number one. Oni is a close second. I love Oni. Death Mask. Eh. Death Mask albums are weird, but I love their self-titled and, and Oni. Those are so interesting. This song so good i love this side of darko i love the the more experimental side of darko which is weird to say because they have always been experimental but they've kind of settled into their groove of being darko and not really moving away from that a, a little bit they do a little bit of that i just made no sense grammatically with what i said um but They've moved away from it a little bit, but I really like when they do little stuff like this, like having something different. They had some of this in Shanghai, too, like the last section of Shanghai, which got really weird and like lo-fi metal. That was interesting, and I really liked that. And then this, too, where it went to cleans there at that ending part, it's more experimenting. It's more trying some things that you know they've done before but they don't normally do it's not a, a constant for them I have, I have hiccups right now i don't know what is happening but it's just really interesting to see all of this new stuff and to see bands do new things even if the new things they've done before but just something different something different than just the same old things and darko does that really really well i think rampage which was uh when did they release that it was like the middle of last year i think rampage is kind of more of the same it's a really really good track it's really good as a darko song but it's just more darko but with shanghai and this specifically i think they're kind of doing more of the other stuff that i really like um were there any other singles that were released okay yeah it was it was shanghai it was bunny suit shanghai rampage no the, okay those are the only three singles so i have heard all the singles so yeah all right i'm really excited for whatever album they have coming oh dude the art for bunny suit on spotify reminds me uh here i can probably pull it up on on youtube too yeah right here the art this drew's video the art for this reminds me more of the pre-Oni era. Editing Corey here, I forgot to say, but it also reminds me of Dealer. And I just saw there's a new Dealer track after like five years, so I need to check that out. And I will do a video on that soon. Anyway, back to this. Oni felt like a big shift in their artwork, and I'm not the big, not the biggest fan of Oni's artwork, but, th oops, but this sort of style, I don't know, the weird sort of like this thing on the side, I, I love that. I, I don't like the neon stuff that they're doing that they did with Oni. And they have a little bit on the covers of... What did they do it for Rampage? Yeah, Rampage in Shanghai, where it's like a neon sort of sci-fi thing. I'm not the biggest fan of that, but that's just my personal preference. The music is great, though. Music's really, really cool. All right, yeah. They did my favorite chord progression. And I love that. So big props to them for that too, but this was this was really really cool. Big fan of that. And I'm sure this song is gonna grow on me just like every other Darko song does, where I love it first listen, but I start to catch to, onto the more intricate things as it progresses and as I listen to it over and over. I catch more things, and that's sort of the beauty of Darko is they kind of hit you over the head with their sound, and then you start to unravel more of what it is what it's about that's kind of how i felt with oni where i didn't even really like oni on my first listen and now i love it and i have listened to it a ton of times it's so much fun it, it's it's just fun i think that's a good word to describe their music it's just fun and music needs to be more fun make music fun again that's going to be my channel slogan I'll, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have little 
little red hat that say MMFA. Uh, make music fun again. Mfa. There you go. There's my channel slogan. I want music to be more fun. People take themselves too seriously. Ah, you know, time and place. Alright, well, thanks for watching. Thanks for all your support and everything that you do to support my channel. It's been great. Even though I've been just doing this for a few months, I have loved this. Can't wait to see where I go from here. Thanks for everything. Uh, I will have a special announcement soon. It'll come in the form of a decently long form video essay kind of thing. But that will be the first part of something that I am planning. And then I will have it as, uh, there'll be more parts as a perk for some patrons. So stay tuned for that. And hopefully get my, my patrons some more perks, get some more bang for their, for their buck. Um, but I may have revealed what it is on one of my Patreon full album reaction videos. So when you want to check that out, patreon.com slash Corey Clip. Anyway, have a good day. Thanks for watching. Uh, all, you know, all the things. Take care. See ya. Bye. Peace out.